Reason number 437 why it's useful to have a solid state Tesla coil around. Here we have a pulse start 100 watt metal halide high intensity, de intensity discharge lamp that was marked as a probe start or electrode start which have a third electrode at the bottom which allows for low voltage starting off of a normal magnetic ballast. Here we have a normal magnetic ballast. This is 175 watts, but it's close enough for all intents and purposes. It will be overdriving the lamp, but not bad enough to be an issue. Simply wired on there because this is a mogul socket and that is a medium base. That just goes to mains. Proximity to the Tesla coil. Allows for capacitive coupling. Just enough to get the arc started, as you'll see. The coil will be running for about a second and a half, just enough to initiate the arc, and then it runs off of the mains voltage here. Let me prop that up. Alright. Main voltage being applied to the ballast. Armed. Tesla coil is armed. Zero power going in. I'm going to crank the uh, Variac to approximately 14 volts, which is around the starting voltage. That's all that's needed. And it's back off. It does close off again. Turn off room lights. I'm going to move the camera because it's not too happy. There's full brightness. I don't want to run it too much so the bulb doesn't pop. So, thanks for watching.